Well, I'm just sitting here wondering if there's a little toy for me to tear up today because I'm bullet and nothing's bulletproof. Snap! As you can see, we've got a new toy today. It is uh, from the company Top Paw. It's called Another Fire Hydrant Snake. Yes, Bullet is going to attempt to see what he can do with this toughy paw, or tough paw, uh, snakey poo right here. Um, he's super excited. I'm going to go ahead and grab the tags off and see what's going on. Okay, today's toy has an easy rip-offable tongue, a flat little base with some eyes on it. It's made out of heavy-duty fire hose stuff and has one, <laughs> two, and three big size squeakers. Now, he is anxious to get at it. Yeah. Uh, he is definitely going to probably get to these, but I don't know how long it's going to take. So we're going to find out. Are you ready? Let's get ready to rumble. Okay, so here is Mr. Snakey Poo 30 minutes later. Oh, he looks pretty rough. Oh, his middle guts are all out. Squeaker almost, he almost yanked it all the way out. And then the bottom. But, <laughs> top one and bottom ones still work. And here's what it looks like in an over top view. Here's the squeaker that came from the middle one and another piece of plastic that he's chewed off of here. This thing, these things have huge squeakers in them, but this stuff is tough stuff to get through. You can see he was really chewing hard on that stuff. Uh, this fire hose is extra durable, extra strong. And I can say that this and this is bulletproof but this is not so I think it was just on his personal preference he did tear up the face tear off the little tongue that it had of course we knew that was gonna go he didn't touch the eyes or anything they're just I don't know if they're iron on or what but this is definitely extremely bullet resistant if you were to buy one of these and actively play with your dog use it as a fetch toy I would highly highly recommend that and the Top Paw Company definitely were, you know, doing their homework when they decided to start using this fire hose material because you could just see bullets struggling and struggling with this, trying to get through it. It is amazing, this stuff, this heavy nylon and this rubber undercoat it's got on here. If you look at that. That stuff is really hard for him to get torn through. So what I'm going to do is see how much longer it's going to take for him to get squeaker A and squeaker C out. And then you be the judge on if it's bulletproof. <laughs> Snakey poo seems like a uh, bullet got serious took him 11 minutes to get the uh, last two squeakers out six minutes on one and five minutes on the other one so. this would be highly bullet resistant but not quite bulletproof we still have not been able to find anything that's actually bulletproof that means he could go through and play with it for a good 30 minutes to an hour without destroying it ripping out squeakers etc uh, we've been mostly looking at softer toys. Um, I mean, I've seen him tear up Kongs, but those take a while. But we might go venture into some other realms and see what we can find out. If you have any ideas for this, leave a comment below. And uh, definitely don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you later.